YouTube, uh, it is time for day nine <laughs> of the 31 days of tarot. And our question is, what was a memorable reading in 2019? So, um, the most, the one that jumps right into my head, and maybe because it was towards the end of the year, but it was very blah kind of reading, was um, one that I, I did actually during um, a tarot thon in November, uh, Kittens, Weights, and Tarot, that uh, YouTube channel, um, did this Hero's Journey spread, and I did this reading like live as during the, the, during the live, um, pulling cards, and it was, like, almost all majors. I think eight of the twelve cards I laid down were majors, um, and very, like, whoo, oh boy, there were a lot of, like, connections between cards and just, yeah, it was a really interesting, like, the spread is, it's a circle, like a clock a clock face and um kind of goes through the the elements of the hero's journey like the storytelling frame um but you know you you are the per or the hero in the tale um and it was so um so like just uh that um i actually am planning in 2020 to spend some time with each card of the 12 on a monthly basis. So like card one in January, card two in February, um, and kind of almost work through the hero's journey for the year. Um, because it was, it was for a 2020 tarathon, so I think it's sort of intended to be like your story of the year. Um, so that one really stands out to me. I would also give honorable mention though to a couple of, um, over the summer, a couple of readings I did based on um, the moons, I think it was the eclipses maybe, I can't remember exactly, but um, a couple of the word witch, Claire, Claire at the word witches um, spreads, uh, their spreads are just always really on point for me and there were a couple, I know there's a cancer one and I can't remember the other, that were just like, oh my god, um, so those were also great but I can't, I can't remember the details of them, but I highly recommend um, you can find them online um, if you look for the word witch. Uh, the, the moon spreads that they do um, can be really awesome. So there you go. Um, as always, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already to stay caught up on 31 Days of Tarot, and we'll see you tomorrow.